translabyrinthine approach is performed by first placing a C-shaped scalp flap behind the ear. Following that, a drilling of all the mastoid air cells, the cochlea, and the labyrinth is performed until a large opening measuring 4 by 4 centimeters is created and the dura of the posterior fossa is exposed. Once that is completed, a second team of surgeons is introduced, the dura is opened, the cerebellum is retracted posteriorly, and the tumor is identified, most commonly either an acoustic neuroma or a meningioma. The tumor is gradually resected piecemeal using traditional microsurgical techniques. Once the tumor resection is completed, the cerebellum is released and the retractor is removed. A piece of abdominal fat graft is harvested and used as a graft in order to minimize the chance of leakage of cerebrospinal fluid from the large opening in the skull. Following that, the scalp flap is repositioned and sutured in place followed by a pressure dressing. The procedure routinely requires a stay in the intensive care unit followed by a one-week hospital stay.